Hello and welcome to another video tutorial on unit conversion. Now in this example, we'll be trying to look at a very famous gemstone. Uh, maybe you've heard of the blue diamond. It's usually known as the blue diamond because it's actually is blue in the naked eye, but it's actually will emit a red phosphorescence color when Im uh, subjected to ultraviolet light. Now the interesting is uh, the interesting part is rather is uh, the history of the blue diamond. Many have said that there is a there is a curse behind it. Now whatever that is, it's not part of this video tutorial. All right. So what we are concerned here is that it is containing 45.52 carats. Now a carat is a unit of mass for your gemstones or your precious uh, stones. All right. So we'll try to convert this unit, 45.52 carats, into the unit in kilograms. Alright, so let's do that by looking at our equivalent statement. Alright, so we have here our equivalent statements. We have 1 carat is equal to 0 0.2 grams approximately. Then of course, from kilogram, uh, sorry, from grams to kilograms, that's 1,000 grams per kilogram. Alright, so we will be needing this equivalent statement and transforming them into the corresponding conversion factors. So I have given you here the whole picture of the solution, but we have two blanks, meaning we will be using these two equivalent statements in their conversion factor form for us to solve the problem. So we are starting with a unit in carats. So the first conversion factor should contain the unit carats, and it should be in the denominator. So let's write that down. All right, so I have now written the unit in the proper places so we'll now see the cancellation of our unit carats all right so we're now left with the unit in grams but our final or desired unit is in kilograms so we still need one more conversion factor so let us write that down and we have it here and our equivalent statement is transformed into conversion factor making sure that the units are properly placed for us to see the cancellation grams so we are now left with the final desired unit which is in kilograms. So all we need to do is solve or calculate and report our final answer. And after doing the calculation, we arrive to our answer that is 9.104 times 10 raised to the power of negative 3. But before you report your final answer, you have to look back to our given and determine the correct number of significant figures. So we have here four significant figures. Now remember the equivalent statements will not help determine the number of significant figures. You always have to look at the given. So we, since we have four, so our final answer should also contain four significant figures. All right, so our final answer is 9.104 times 10 to negative three kilograms. That is the value in kilograms for your blue diamond. So that's all for this video. Thank you for listening and continue learning.